I was running away. It was Sofra was the name and not your maiden name until you told me what it was and then I realised why you couldn't run an accountancy firm <laughs> Do with you that want me name. to say? Yes. <laughs> it's old chaos. Chaos. <laughs> yeah, chaos. We got called that quite often at school. I've had an accountant like that. Oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's a good thing that we didn't do that. Sofra's way easier to say. Yeah. Tracy, I'm really interested in WOW. Tell me about it. WOW is my brainchild and it's really my passion about bringing regional women together and regional women that are like-minded, regional women that don't have the opportunity because of geography to be able to go to Melbourne midweek. Sounds like regional women who like cocktails and dinners. Well, cocktails and dinners are good, workshops are good, but we want to grow, we want to experience, we want to, I guess, encourage and connect with each other. I think that's a really strong point for women. I don't get me into trouble to say this, but it sounds a bit like the CWA, the old CWA on steroids. Yeah, it could be, but we don't bake. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's, it's a fantastic group. And this is our third year and we've, it's built a, a momentum of its own. And um, I think we're making an impact on the community and in the greater Shepparton area. And that's what we want to do. What's the future? Um, the, one of my greatest passions is education and my belief for education mm. and educating young women and older women. And in fact, um, WOW has a scholarship fund. Absolutely. The reason I'm talking about this is it's so much more interesting than what you do for a living. Well, yes, um, yes, accounting isn't the most, uh, what, exciting, you know, when you say you're an accountant, people leave the room, but... And yet, you've done great things in accountancy yes, here in Shepherd. Yes, we have. I think it comes down to who you are and how you see the world and your perception of things. So, you know, accounting is my toolbox, but how do I make that happen for people? And it's about listening to people and being empathetic and loving what you do and constantly evolving. You know, they bandy innovation. I mean, I've been talking about innovation or we, we think about innovation in our practice every day of the week. How can we do things better? How can we service our clients better? What can we bring to the table that makes your life easier? As a financial planner, do you, uh, in a self-interested way, being a Shepparton girl, recommend investment here? Absolutely. Investment in Shepparton is absolutely on the cards. And what always interests me about Shepparton, and in this case again, is that you're talking about a product that I would expect to go to Collins Street to buy, but you're doing it here. It's a beautiful, beautiful part of of Victoria, of Australia. I love Shepparton. Shepparton is my home and has been since I was 11 years old. There's some really good people here. There's beautiful industry here. The weather's fantastic. It's easy to get around. You've got an $80 million business. Clients everywhere. Yeah. Not just here. No, so we service clients, that? well, I think because we're real. I think because we're genuine and we actually care. I've got clients who have uh, retired and moved to Cairns and I still see them. So they, they stay with us, they don't change their accountants or their financial planners and we stretch as far as Sydney and everyone we speak to seems to just come on board. Melbourne, we've got an office in Melbourne. You know, I talk here and I think one of the great resource bases here is a variety of human genetics. You know, what, 40 nations here, yourself, you come from Turkey. Yes, and I you're do. married to an Italian. Yes, I, yes, I am. the company, Sofra. Sofra, yes, yeah, Sofcorp and Sofra. The diversity is brilliant and diversity is so important because without diversity, we'd have a, a, a same product and diversity brings about different ideas and different points of view and not one person can know the answer to everything, can they? Just talking about Turkey for a moment, you're from Ankara, aren't yes. you? Yes. Yeah. I've been there, I've been to some terrific restaurants there. Do you make Turkish delight? No. I think you're a Turkish delight. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for talking to Thank me. Thank you, Charles.